marks one full month of business at the Taste of Lindsay Heights. It's near 17th and North Avenue. And that neighborhood is bounded by Locust to the north, Walnut to the south, I-43 to the west, and 100, or I should say 12th Street to the east. Tony Atkins takes a look at what brought business owners together with a shared purpose. So you wanted two apple and gingers, right? It's a small carryout cafe along busy North Avenue, but in less than a month, its presence in the community is anything but small. Your total comes to $10. Okay. Eight entrepreneurs of color, all linked together, providing the neighborhood with fresh, healthy food to go. Traces Wright, a Lindsay Heights resident of 25 years, comes often. So having this business here, a new business, we're reimagining re Lindsay Heights. The concept is a collective effort um, for the residents of the Lindsay Heights area to take their side hustles and scale them to the next level. Chandra Ellis is the general manager. She also runs her personal business, Golden Honey Juice and Company. It's vital to her to promote wellness in the inner city with things like spring rolls, fruits, lemonade, probiotic ginger shots, potato salad, and more, all available. The taste is also a fresh food access point, so that's important for a community like Lindsay Heights and many other communities throughout the country. A shop filled with entrepreneurs, each with their own stories to tell. Amani Rain Moore runs Creative Fruits. Her passion for fruit carving is not only her business, it's also a craft that keeps her close to her late mother. When me and my mother were diagnosed with lupus, it was our therapy to get through. I love being able to be in the community and being able to pass that therapy on in a different light. When I was asked to come here, it was, it was, I was overjoyed. Donna Owens runs Delectables by Donna, specializing in catering and her Bach chicken salads. She thinks what she's a part of will benefit the community for years to come. Absolutely, absolutely. I believe from here, it gets bigger. A small step toward a healthier Milwaukee. In Lindsay Heights, Tony Atkins, TMJ4 News.